In the Sunday paper, we're committed to illuminating every facet of our job, highlighting gifted change agents and covering narratives that cut through the clutter and advance humankind. In light of this, we are delighted to announce that The Open Field, under Maria Shrivar's label, will release a caregiving manual authored by Emma Hemming Willis in 2025. Emma will write about her experiences in her new role as Bruce Willis's caretaker in the book. Bruce has been diagnosed with frontotemporal dementia. In the end, this intelligent, inspirational handbook for anyone looking for aid while dealing with a loved one's cognitive decline will include interviews and professional guidance. Emma has been vocal about one of the most difficult aspects of being a caregiver ever since Bruce's diagnosis, feeling knowledgeable, ready, and a part of a group of others who have gone through similar things, Emma said, in my view, having information is akin to possessing strength and establishing a network of support has proven to be indispensable for me. When frontotemporal dementia first emerged within our family, it completely appended any sense of control. It has restored stability and a sense of control. If you let it, dementia can not only have an impact on your loved one but also append the foundation of your entire family. Finding the appropriate resources to educate and empower oneself has been uplifting, and it has made it possible for me to go forward in the most constructive manner in order to be the greatest friend, wife, mother, daughter, and caregiver that I can be. I want to be able to impart it to the next individual that comes across this. Emma was questioned last week by the Sunday paper about the knowledge she wants to impart to people who have been diagnosed with frontotemporal dementia and are frequently confused and prevalent in the community. She specifically stated to the Sunday paper, for many people, their first touchpoint with this disease comes in their doctor's office. I believe that the way in which the doctor shares this information with the patient and their family members is crucial. It is imperative that resources and information are easily accessible. Our tales are regrettably similar, as I have learned from both my own experiences and those of other caregivers I have spoken to. With no tools or direction, we were left with a diagnosis that I could hardly discuss with anyone. Emma described walking with mom and her family as a helpful, compassionate, and loving, akin to what a social worker would do. She said to us, why did I have to look for assistance and answers on the internet? And everyone is aware of the lengths to which that might lead. We are deeply grateful to Maria's label, The Open Field, for releasing this essential book, which is made possible by Emma's truth, patience, and brightness at this dark time. Emma has written for the Sunday paper and informed our readership with her incredible and sincere viewpoint, so we are familiar with her potent writing. Emma has trusted The Open Field imprint to get her words into the hands and homes of millions of caregivers, and we are honored by that. Emma's book is a labor of love for Maria, both personally and professionally. Maria said, I am ecstatic that Emma's book about caregiving is being released. We've been friends for a long time and I really admire how she's utilizing her voice to advocate for others. Caregivers are unsung heroes in our society, they require assistance, information, and a sense of community. That's what the new book from the open field will give them. I am incredibly happy and proud.